I want to play with it. I like playing with it. I... Hey, how are you? This is Stephen Kramer Glickman. Here's my magic ball that I got, which is pretty magical. Uh, from a uh, funny guy from TV on YouTube, youtube.com forward slash funny guy from TV, uh, from Big Time Rush, this guy right here from Nickelodeon. Um, you may, I'm going to be answering your Twitter responses. I'm going to be making the Twitters, the Twitter response video from Sunday, November 7th, 2010. Here we go. BTR underscore Chicago underscore ST said, do you like pickles? Yes, but only kosher dill pickles. Uh, MegZ32213 said, what is the best thing about each of one of the boys on Big Time Rush? Well, I, I can't, I can't I, I, they're all really wonderful in their own way. All right? They're all really special. I care about them in their own really special ways. They're special guys. They're my special guys. Here we go. Thoughts on the Jonas Brothers from BTR underscore Chicago underscore ST. I like the I like the Jonas. I don't dislike the Jonas. I'm 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 friends with the little Frankie Jonas. Nice he's a nice kid. Little short, little funny kid. They're all nice people. Alright? Everybody's they're all good or something, right? Uh, any chance of background or extra roles on Big Time Rush says Fluent Ninja Eleven. Um, well, I wouldn't want to be an extra on Big Time Rush since I'm already a series regular. I think I'd want to be an extra. Oh, for you to be an extra, um, that would take uh, moving to uh, Hollywood and joining Central Casting. Um, BTR underscore Chicago underscore ST. Who makes you laugh most on set? Who makes me laugh? Uh, Tanya makes me laugh the most because she's hilarious. She plays Kelly. Uh, Robert underscore Aram says, "Is it fun being Gustavo and yelling at the boys?" Yes, it is. It's a lot of fun. I like to yell all the time, and if I had a choice, I'd yell more than I would talk. Uh, roar! Speaking of which, which is your favorite kind of dinosaur? Says BTR underscore Chicago underscore ST. I have a feeling uh, uh, BTR underscore Chicago underscore ST is uh, eight years old. There's, I'm going to guess because he likes dinosaurs. And that you kind of stop caring about dinosaurs usually around nine years old. Unless you become a paleontologist. Am I right about that? All right. Um... <laughs> BTR fan 15. Have you ever gotten a gift from a fan? Yes, I have. I actually received a gift today. <gasps> Would you grab it? Go grab it. Okay, uh, we were at an art fair today, uh, like a little street fair on the corner of Fairfax and Melrose. Um, and uh, this little girl gave me a painting, which she had painted, and I thought it was really awesome. So guess what? Boom. Here it is. This is what she did. It's Buddha Man. Which is weird. It kind of looks a little, a little like me, which is kind of, kind of sad. Um, except I don't have the rosy cheeks, and I'm wearing a lot of clothes, and I don't have. I'm much better looking. Um, this is from Sunny. So good job, Sunny. Favorite BTR song. Um, favorite BTR song has gotta be. And there's lots of great. Um, I just got a text message from Nikki Blonsky from Hairspray. Look at that. You don't know if you can see it. There's Nikki! And she just sent me a text message! Yeah! Alright, let's see. Um, now, I'm not going to get through all this. I may. I have 300 questions to answer. There's no way I'm going to do this. I've done like five questions. What's the strangest thing that's ever happened to you on set? I got um, buried in the last episode up to my neck. I was buried. Uh, in dirt and foam rubber. That was very strange. That's the weirdest thing. You, I'm sure you'll see that episode. Um, I made the boys shirts. Can you... I gave them to them in Chicago. Will you please ask if they got them? Sure, I will. I will totally ask. I will totally ask. Guess what? I already asked. I just asked right now. They said yes. Um, what race are you? 
is you? What race is is you? I'm Jewish. I'm Russian and Polish, but all in all, Canadian. Oh, yeah, yeah. And Czechoslovakian. What is the strangest thing or other people do? Oh, that's the same question. Uh, do you like Jersey Shore, says Katie Nelson 35 Um, the answer to that is simple. I uh, knew. No. I don't. Um, what is your favorite month of the year? October for Halloween. Zzz, uh, and December's pretty great. And March, because it's my birthday! On St. Patrick's Day! On a scale from 1 to 10, how much fun is it working on Big Time Rush? Says Miss Maslow Bieber. <coughs> wow, you're married to James Maslow and Justin Bieber. Shocking. Shock. It's a uh, scale of 1 to 10. Guess what? 37. That's right. It's 30, it's 37 is the right number. Greatest decade from Chicago BTR underscore ST. I don't know what's going on now because now I'm getting now BTR underscore Chicago ST also asked me to marry them. I don't know who that person is. I'm not. Sh I have not. Uh, um, no, I'm gonna stay single for a little while longer. Maybe we'll see. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Will I do another episode of Drink This? It's so funny. I can't get enough of it, says Julia Loves Maslow. Julia, thank you. I would love to do another episode of that. So guess what? I will make one if, just for you. I think we're going to do ones about milk. Is that right? Milk comes next on Drink This. Drink This with milk. That's coming soon. Um... What's the most embarrassing thing that ever happened to me in high school? Well, uh, BTR, that's BTR Chicago, uh, underscore ST. This, she, this person asked a lot of questions. Um, most embarrassing thing that ever happened to me in high school? I can tell this story. What? Oh, yeah. Um, when I was in high school, I was in um, theater. As, as lots of people do theater. Um, and I was asked if I wanted to join the mime troupe. So I did. I put the white face on with the little triangles. And I did the mime. I did mime. Um, <coughs> and then they made us perform mime. Like the mime, as a mime troupe. In front of the whole high school. Okay. Nobody likes mimes okay and nobody likes high school students that are mimes you understand i got beat up a lot for that but guess what it was worth it no it wasn't I would suggest not becoming a mime when you're in high school. That might help. Um, all right, we got time for one last question. Here we go. Stop. 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 Do you dress like Gustavo normally out in public? Says Marlo World. All right, are you ready for this? Normally. I just wear a leotard wherever I go. A giant silver leotard. It's normally just what I wear. Uh, no, yes, I do. I am uh, sponsored by a bunch of uh, clothing companies, and I wear those clothes on the show as well as in real life. And I happen to also... Uh, I, I think... Did I just say I own a clothing company? I said that, right? All right. Um, well, guess what? The clothes are being delivered tomorrow morning. And I can't wait to show them to you. So the second I get them, I'm going to show them. But you can kind of see what they look like. Here's one of them is right here. This is one of them right there. It's on my phone. You can kind of 
see it right there. That's one of the shirts right there. That's one of the shirts right there. There's a whole bunch of cool shirts. So, all right, well, guess what? It's been 11 minutes and 19 seconds, and I love you guys. I've answered a lot of questions. I've tried my best, even though there's a lot of, you know, I tried my best. I really tried my best. But I love you guys, so thanks for asking me questions, and I'm going to keep on answering this stuff. Okay, I'll see you later. Was you think this one was good?